today, I'm Crystal Paco and you're watching The Good Life, a show where we highlight all the good things happening on our island. We start by heading to Corfest, a first of its kind recently held at the Hyatt. It was an invitation-only event to introduce the community to Strongbow Apple Ciders. Brand manager Jessica Leon Guerrero. It really is a true apple cider made from all apples, really nice and refreshing by nature. Tell us, you know, what makes it different or where can I drink this? You know, it's cider, it's cider time anytime, you know, it's a really nice refreshing drink. Um, we actually have three different flavors that we sell on Guam, so we have a red apple, a gold apple and a honey. Really nice flavors um, and like I said, it's, it's really tr made from true apples, it goes through a process. Uh, cider is not a big category on Guam, but definitely a great opportunity. So we're excited about it, we're excited about Strongbow. We're we're so glad to represent it, and it's definitely cider time. Corefest featured local performers, pop rocks and soda, and Hawaiian artist Anohea with artificial grass and lighting to replicate what one might find at an apple orchard. It was nothing but good vibes. showcase a brand. Um, we have a, a the event's called Core Fest. It's derived from an apple core, um, but we really wanted to create an experience where people will be able to try ciders, enjoy it, understand what ciders is, and we brought out uh, Ana Hea, singer-songwriter, to come out, uh, give a great performance, um, and what better way to enjoy ciders and Strongbow with a great event, listening to great music, um, and like I said, it's we wanted to bring the nature. Unfortunately, the weather kind of posed a little bit of an issue, but rain or shine, we made sure it was cider time. So, you know, we brought the, even through the weather, weather we made sure that we brought the outdoors indoors. is quite new to the island um, so a lot of it came into people didn't understand what ciders is is, is strongbow uh, an, a beer or is it what is it and when we would say ciders people won't understand what that is so we created an education center where we took people through the process and we actually had at the crushing of the the apples to the making of the juice and then it goes through a fermentation process and then you end up with a great product so you know it was really important that people understood not that they were only drinking a great brand and a great cider, but how what a cider actually is. So is it a chick drink? You know what, it, it's amazing. All the different flavors really appease to all types of demographics, females and males. I've had some guys come and say, I'm so glad you have it. Ever since you brought it, that's my drink of choice. I mean, I've had guys, we have a red berry, you know, and it's really nice, it's, it's a red drink. Um, and they said it's my ultimate favorite. So, you know, it, it really comes down to it. We, we bring out as much flavors as we can so that we can find a flavor for everyone. But it's very versatile. Even if, it, if you're a girl or a guy, it doesn't matter. You know, you'll, you'll definitely enjoy it. It's really good. 
is the berry, and that's because I'm very awesome. <laughs> My favorite is the gold. It's really good. Mine too is gold. Gold is hands down the best. It's good they have hearts of gold. Oh, yeah, right, you know. Right. I, I love the gold because I have a heart of gold. Still to come on The Good Life, we'll check out what the Guam Micronesian Chefs Association's got cooking.